friends, let's learn about dinosaurs. Dinosaurs first appeared 253 million years ago. Let's learn some of them. First, we'll start the king of the dinosaurs, which is the T-Rex. It is a carnivore dinosaur. Now we'll do with the Ankylosaurus. The Ankylosaurus is a herbivore and it's one of the strongest dinosaurs. Now we will do the Triceratops. This is a Triceratops. The Triceratops is again a herbivore and it has a shield to guard and horns. Now we will do the Brachiosaurus. The Brachiosaurus is one of the biggest dinosaurs in the world and it is again a herbivore. Now we'll do the Apatosaurus. The Apatosaurus ah, is also one of the biggest dinosaurs but this is a baby Apatosaurus. That's why this is small. But actually the Apatosaurus are, even, are like big, bigger than the Brachiosaurus. That's why they have been seen as they are one of the biggest dinosaurs in the world. Now we'll do the Allosaurus. The Allosaurus is a ferocious carnivore dinosaur which eat and it is really fast as well. Now we'll do the Stegosaurus. The Stegosaurus, it has plagues all around it and spikes on its tails which is one of the things which makes it one of the strongest dinosaurs. And plus it's a herbivore. And here's the Velociraptor. The Velociraptor are, by, are the fastest dinosaur in the world. And there are also some small dinosaurs which are really, really ferocious. Now we'll do the Spinosaurus. So there are two kinds of Spinosaurus. One is which walks on two feet like human and one is which walks on four feet like this one. And this is a carnivore dinosaur and the reason why they, it's called the Spinosaurus because it has a spine and it's one of these dinosaurs which can breathe in water. This is a Pachycephalosaurus. The Pachycephalosaurus is called the king of the headbutters. That means if it headbutts you with its head, then your head will like go damage everything. So that's why this is called the headbutting king. And the Pachycephalosaurus is a herbivore. That's why some people think it's a peaceful dinosaur. This is a Fairysaurus. The Fairysaurus has a shield and beak that can see, the beaks can see that it is clearly a herbivore. And this is a Parasaurolophus. One special thing about the Parasaurolophus, you can see this right here, this uh, crib kind of thing, and this makes music. This makes beautiful good music and also loud which irritates people uh, from the English dinosaurs these music help a lot that's why this is one of the special things about them and they are herbivores as well this is an iguanodon the iguanodons are also a herbivore but not as strong as these dinosaurs So now let's go to our final dinosaur, which is the Stratosaurus. The Stratosaurus is really close friend. It looks really much like the Triceratops. And it's one of the Triceratops families. And that's why uh, 
is also called the Triceratops family members and it also is a really dangerous dinosaur. And here I'm going to tell you a special thing. We have most the Triceratops family, the Ferrosaurus, Strapasaurus and the Triceratops are all the Triceratops groups, Triceratops groups. They're divided into groups. So please like this video and subscribe to Namish World.